The Purple Heart Medal, one of the most recognized and respected awards in the U.S. Army, and today, one that was lost was returned to the family of a man who died serving our country with honor. Bill Shields takes us to the emotional reunion at St. Mary's Cemetery today in Canton. Stacy Rolfe has always known her grandfather's brother died in World War II during the Normandy invasion, and that Harold Rolfe was buried here in Canton. But she didn't know much more until recently. He died during Operation Cobra, which was the last day of Normandy as they pushed into uh, further into France and Germany. So Harold Rolfe was awarded a Purple Heart Medal posthumously, but his widow remarried after the war, and the medal was lost until a couple in Florida stumbled across it. The story was just unfolding, and it was such a beautiful tale um, that just kept going and going and going. The Florida couple contacted Major Zachariah Fike of Purple Hearts Reunited. Here we are on the exact date that he died on 25 July, uh, some 70 years ago. And uh, we get an opportunity to memorialize him and bring essentially a piece of him back to his family. So today, 72 years to the day that Harold Rolfe died in France, his medal was returned to the family. He didn't lose his life in vain. We're still really honoring his memory now that we know more about him. So how many other Harold Rolfs are out there? Perhaps thousands. These are just a few. That's thousands of families waiting to have honor restored to them. In Canton, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Mm.